Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, and today we're going to do the five marker challenge. I have a special guest with me, my brother, and he has been in a few other videos. And so how we're going to do this is Colin will mix up the thing while I close my eyes, and then I'm going to pick five markers, closing my eyes, and then I'm going to do the challenge, and you guys are going to comment down below who you think won that round. So let's get right on into it. Okay, Colin, I'll pick my colors first, so you mix those up. And as you can see, my eyes are closed, so I cannot see. All right, here you go. Okay. Hands right there. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, these are pretty good colors for a palm tree. I think I got pretty lucky. I don't think what you. I don't think they know what the what we're doing. Like what they are. The round is a palm tree. Okay, now close your eyes. I'm gonna mix it up for you. Okay, Con. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> now you we gotta take our first piece of paper and make a palm tree with it. But there isn't a certain amount of time we're doing it, so we're just like, as, as soon as we're both done. So, my cameraman Mandy's gonna come over and show everyone what we're doing. Oh, this is the neon yellow. There. Make it look a little bit like sand. Because palm tree, is it? Am I correct? Palm tree? Oh, and another rule is you have to use all five colors. And if you don't, you'll just like have to put it in. You guys can come on down below, like vote who. Already said that. <laughs> oh, my base is, looks pretty good. Now I need to use gray and green. Yeah. You're messing me up here, I mean. Oh, he got a purple base. That's nice. Yeah, I know. You got some pretty good colors. Oh, that's a good shape. Now I need to make all the rest look like that. And I don't. It's kind of hard to draw on those wooden tables. Ooh, my palm tree's turning out really good, actually. Hey, you have somebody right by here. I can hear you. And I'm gonna use some yellow to make this palm tree look more real. Ugh, I'll just come here. I think I, this looks pretty good. The only color I need to add into it is some gray, and I think some gray sand will look pretty cool. So Mandy, would you like to give a close-up shot? <laughs> and just so you guys know, my brother is three years younger than me, so my drawing may be a little better because I have more years of experience. And I'm not really a drawer too. Hi Angel! So the pillows turned out, and now we're gonna move on to the second round. 
now, which is ice cream. So we're gonna make an ice cream cone. Oh. Wait, so can we put it in a cup or a cone? A cup. Just a cup or a cone? It doesn't matter. Shuffle. We might have some interesting flavors of ice cream. Who is barking? Okay, ready? Okay, where is it? One, two. What are you laughing about? Okay. Ooh, this could be strong. 
dress. It's gonna be a very interesting dress and color. Can I, I really wanted to right get, now? I really wanted to get a blue because I wanted to make a stitch. I think I'm gonna make a princess, but I don't know which princess. I'm gonna make a minion. A minion? Yeah. Okay. A minion. I'm gonna think. I'm Never gonna be mean to a minion. I'm gonna make. What Disney movies have I seen lately? I'm gonna make a. I'm gonna make a princess. Very strange princess. Yeah, my name's not gonna be also great, so. I think Colin's gonna win because he has better colors. Who said that? The Spickamobi people. I'm just gonna draw it pretty fast because, I mean, I'm not making a very detailed princess. She does not need to look pretty. So this princess is gonna be very royal princess. And her name will be Sleeping Beauty. Yes, that's who I'm gonna do. Yup. I just colored her dress pink and I was like, yup, Sleeping Beauty. That's who she's gonna be. She's gonna have some purple sh slippers on, some purple shoes. Um, I guess she changed, oh, oh that's out. Oh. And she's going to have some purple glass slippers. Wait, no, that's a different princess story. She's going to have some purple um, shoes that are very big, but she likes big shoes because she's very interesting. And, and she's going to have some green. Oh, she's gonna have a green face because I think that will turn darker. Green eyes, green nose, green mouth. She's gonna have some brown, dark, dark, dark hair. And she's gonna have a dark neck and I need to use one last color and it's this one. And it's going to be um, for the belt on her dress. I don't think she has a belt, but she does in this story. Okay, this is my awful princess, Sleeping Beauty. <laughs> so Colin is working on his minion for the last round, and I think it's pretty good. I actually really, really, really wanted to get at least one blue so I could do Lilo or Stitch from Lilo and Stitch. Because he's such a cute character, and he'd be a challenge. Todd, you almost done? And I know, with your minion. Got little hairs, and there's my minion. So, these are all done together. I'm going to hold up mine, and Colin's going to hold up his. Colin, grab yours, in order. Okay. Let me grab mine. Oh, of mine are better. Just kidding. So, so these are mine, my round one, my round two, my round three. Colin, show me yours. Round one, over here, round two, round three. And we also have three more rounds, but that will be in the no. next video. And that's going to be in the part two of this. So. And everyone, if you like this video, please subscribe, like, and comments. Thank you. Bye. Bye-bye.